Today we're at Jackson Lake and we just brought in some yellow perch from the western slope from Harvey Gap Reservoir. Jackson Lake used to be a really good ice fishery for yellow perch and we'd like to reinstate that. And so we went over and we did some electrofishing at Harvey Gap on the west slope and we caught 8,125 yellow perch ranging anywhere from two inches to about 11 inches. Most of them are about five. And we're gonna go ahead and we stocked those today. And in addition to that, one thing we did last week was stock 840,000 yellow perch eggs. We took the eyed eggs and we attached them to vegetation and substrate in the reservoir in hopes that those will hatch in here. And the fish we stocked today are actually in spawning condition as well, and many of those fish are dropping eggs. So hopefully we'll get some of the reproduction off of those fish as well to kind of boost the yellow perch population in Jackson. So yellow perch are a highly desired species by anglers. They're a good eating fish, and they're fun for kids to catch as well. Um, and then in addition to it being a sport fish, the anglers catch in this reservoir also serves as a prey base for some of the walleye and the wiper and the saw guy that are in the reservoir as well. One of the benefits of moving the yellow perch from the west slope from Harvey Gap Reservoir is that the perch densities are too high there. And so that creates stunted fish, uh, real short fish and skinnier fish. And the biologist over there is looking to improve the fishery there. So in order to do that, we need to move yellow perch. So we moved them out of a lake where they need to be removed from and to a lake where they needed to be stocked. Two years ago, um, we got some eyed eggs from out of state and a biologist in the Southwest region started stocking those um, eyed eggs on substrate. And so we figured we'd try it here in the Northeast region. And so last week was the first, first time that we did that here. Jackson Lake, we've got a good fishery here. Uh, we've built it over the past five to six years. It's really great walleye fishing, really great sogeye fishing, good crappie fishing, and great wiper fishing. Today there's a lot of wiper fishermen out. Um, the wiper bite is pretty hot right now, so we have a lot of guys coming out to fish for those fish. 